Yeah, I'm just gonna do a, a quick demo here of how to use this spreadsheet. It looks like some people are still confused on how to use it, um, primarily because my last video, I was updating the numbers, making changes to the spreadsheet, but that's really not necessary anymore. So um, the current state of the spreadsheet is, as you can see, I, I update the spreadsheet nightly um, so it's ready for the following day's release. If not every night, uh, maybe the following morning. And I've pre-generated about 1,800 or 2,000 or so, not links themselves, but it, it should cover about 2,000 sets, right? So that should be enough for one drop per type of Labulu. So for example, um, big into energy, the first box at number is 1548, and it goes all the way up to 3907. So whatever, 3907 minus 1548, that's how much, uh, how many sets it, it, it covers. So there should be, I guess, long story short, there is no need to touch the spreadsheet. All you have to do is pick a link or a couple of them and just, and start refreshing. Um, well, that's not quite true. Let me explain. So the way it works is that when a release happens, um, like for example, here you go to um, Big Into Energy. When a release happens, you'll see these boxes. What this means is that these two are grayed out. That means that these two are technically have not been checked out. They haven't been purchased and the rest have been purchased. So you can see they're, they're missing. And so that's what that means, right? So if you see these, it means most likely that someone's gonna buy it or a bot is holding on to it. So you can skip these. But I guess my point is that that's how you know an, a, a drop for a big into energy is happening. It's because you see these boxes, they're not empty. You see them, whether gray or not, that means uh, uh, a drop is happening. And so, when a drop happens, again, the times have been changing lately. There's been a more, there's more scheduled drops lately, uh, more than usual. But when the drop happens, you select one of these. So the first box set number, the first link, the, back, the first box set number is gonna be 1548. We know that because the last box set number from yesterday's release was 1547. They go in sequential order which is why this is the first one. Do you want to click on the first link? No, you do not. Again, you want to skip a few hundred. So instead of 1548, you might want to go to, I don't know, 1807 or whatever it is, right? And one more thing, um, I'm skipping every seven here. So if you do like 1807, there's other people that might have chosen that same link. So Maybe you do, maybe change it to 1806 or something like that. So you, it gives you a less chance of uh, someone else having the same link as you do. So when the drop happens, click on one of these links. I would probably recommend something in like an additional 400 or 500 even, just to make sure that you get one or a set. Uh, if you're trying to get more, um, it, it's not really advisable anymore since it's one per account. And they've only been releasing about 1,200 per set, I mean, per type of Labubu, the past couple of drops. So if you just want one or a handful, whatever, I'll set, I would just, instead of 1548, maybe do 2048, something in that range. So um, like 2045 or something, right? So copy this link, open a new, where you can click on it or open a new tab and paste it. Now, you have to keep in mind, you have to, Pay attention. It's loading right now. If it's empty, that means it's been sold. See how this number matches this number? It means that this box, this set has been released, but it, all the boxes have been sold, which is why um, it'll, it'll, it won't show up anymore. So when you see this, ignore it. These are still showing up because while they are grayed out, meaning they're reserved, they're in someone's cart, 
they haven't been fully purchased, which is why the drop is technically still happening, even though these are probably never going to be released because they're being held by a bot. Now, if if we so that means we haven't gone too far, right? Because it's still loading. So now let's take another one. Let's load another one and see what happens here. Let's pay attention. As you can see, it also loaded, it's empty. That means the release wave is past you, right? What that means is that, um, again, you should already know this from the previous videos, they release in waves. These two showing up, by this I mean these, the number that you chose and the number that's being displayed on the, on the screen, if they match, that means that box set is part of the drop, meaning this box set has already been released in today's drop. Now let's choose a really big number. It's, some, it's somewhere here, which I know didn't get released today. Let's see what happens. So if you go too far, you'll see it says the currently selected set is sold. Please choose another set, this number does not match that number, that means that this box number has not been released. It won't be released today because the drop is technically over, but tomorrow it'll most likely be released. So which is why my advice to most people is if the first number, like say for example for, days, for the day's drop is 1548, choose something that's in the middle. like. An additional 500 or 600 so that would be in 15 that'd be 2048 or 2148 right so somewhere around um 2157 somewhere around like here i would choose this maybe choose a couple choose one from from here and then maybe 150 down or something like that choose a couple close these load them in here and then then choose another one here. Just load them both. And wait for them. Right? I mean, again, these are loading because we know the drop is done. These have been released. Well, actually, this hasn't been released. This has been released. This hasn't been released. Can you tell the difference? There's this error right here. And then this box set number does not match this one, meaning it has not been released. So if, if an, an after drop was happening, let's say for tomorrow, choose a link again between 500 to 600. So you're guaranteed that it'll be released for that drop for, for that today's drop. And it's not one of the few hundreds. And then just refresh every 20 seconds or so. Um, again, maybe do a couple of them, uh, about 200 to 300 boxes apart and just, just refresh and wait for it to be released. And hopefully, you chose one uh, that hasn't been chosen yet and the bots haven't gotten it and the people that are clicking these links haven't gone to it yet, right? Again, as, previous, as I ex uh, explained in previous videos is that the people that are clicking these links are basically loading the first few here, which is why you're skipping these and going directly to the middle ones, wait and then just refresh wait for the wave to re for the release batch to get to that box number. And when it does get released, it'll almost likely, most likely be untouched, meaning you can click on buy multiple boxes, click select all and select them all. And that's it. Again, no need to touch the, <laughs> no need to touch the spreadsheet. I'll update it. You'll, uh, it'll say you're ready for June 12 for tomorrow. Um, and I'll have all the information. Um, the only thing that you might want to change is if you select, for example, this one, you know, 2416, maybe train it to like 2417 or something like that um, to minimize the chances of someone else having the same exact link. And I think that's it. Cool. Thanks.